Good morning. This episode comes from outside my deck. I'm planning on going to work in the next few minutes. Instead of sitting in the car, I figure why not appreciate the environment that I have. This nice, huge, beautiful space. So I am sharing my morning blessings from here. So today, Tuesday, June 4th, 2024, it's my daughter's birthday, therefore it's my birthday. Um, I, of course, remember exactly everything that occurred on that day some 30-some years ago. But anyhow, it's going to be a beautiful day. I looked at the weather, and the weather encourages me. Nature encourages me. A lot of people don't realize that everything is one. You know, God put us on this planet for his own entertainment. Everything that we see around us, the trees... I, 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 but the grass, the birds, the bugs, <laughs> nature, everything God has put for our entertainment. So I just want to be able to appreciate that. So we moved to Delaware. I mentioned that I've been here for a year. We moved to Delaware from Maryland. Maryland is a beautiful state. It's not a large state, but it's large in terms of population compared to this state. And, um, it was a lot of congestion, um, you know, environmental hazards, whether that be violence, <laughs> the weather, or chemical substances, or whatever it might be. For me, where I was, it just wasn't environmentally friendly, if that's a word. Oh, yeah, it is. <laughs> um, so I'm more relaxed here, more ease, more calm. It's more peaceful. You can hear the birds in the background. But anyway, God bless us. So, um, every day that I sit in my car and I think about whether or not I should or should not go into the workplace, it's a reflection of where I am as a person. Um, I'm only 53, and I retired due to health reasons a few years ago. And my first thought was that I would be able to live the rest of my life in comfort, relaxation. Um, I'd have to answer to anyone ever again, aside from my husband, but God. And um, I just got to the point where it's like, I can't take instruction anymore. I want to be my own person. So right now we're in the process, a huge hiring process because it's summer. And we have a lot of uh, people who work outside and um, it's just been horrendous. It's, it's not been, um, a process where it's organized and, and there's a one through ten step process or eight through Z step process. Everyone is doing everything um, out of the air so it's been very frustrating for me working at this job. But anyway, in talking about the job, I just want to say be your own person. Have your own voice. Speak up. Talk to your managers. A lot of people say, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to be snitching. No, just talk to your managers about what your challenges are. Talk to them about what you want and how you feel. I want to say since the pandemic, um, people have been getting, or other people have been getting their just deserves. Um, they ask for things and they receive it. They realized that during that time, it was one of the darkest places that we have been in and the people in our generation. And they didn't want people to be depressed. So they started appeasing them. They let them work from home. They started giving them money, started giving them food. They did all these things during the pandemic. So now, why are we any different? Why can't we just ask for what we want? What we need, God will, will <laughs> he will supply us with, but ask for what you want. You know, you don't want to be working on this day. You want to be off this day. You don't want to be in um, the office from this time to this time with you there. You don't want to go to lunch when they tell you to go to lunch. Just speak up and ask for what you want. So I'm in a position where I'm working two days off, two days off. So that's great. It's relaxation. It's continuity, having those two days, starting one thing, being able to finish it up on day two. It gives you relaxation. It gives you pause to reflect on who you are, what you need to do going forward. And I feel like I am, I am, I don't feel like I am totally 150% grateful, 200% grateful, 1000% grateful to God.
for being in a position where I have everything I need. And I'm so happy to say that. I can say, I don't need this job. I don't need this. I don't need that. So, when you go into your workplace, when you go to a situation, just remember, God is God. He's going to provide for you. You don't need to be struggling. You don't need to be suffering. You don't need to be succumbing to any oppression. Just be you. And so it's time for me to go. Have a great day.